Hi there, everyone. Old Trafford is the venue for our match today. Welcome to you all from Alan Smith and myself, Martin Tyler. Today's game, Manchester United against Aston Villa. We've got the highest scoring team taking on the lowest scoring team in the league. On paper, it does seem pretty cut and dried, but it often doesn't work out as simply as that. Yeah, you would imagine it'd be fairly simple to predict the result here, but uh, you never know in football. This is then the Manchester United lineup. The youngster Joel Pereira starts in goal. Paul Pogba starts, looking to continue his great form in midfield. In attack, Romelu Lukaku starts, together with Marcus Rashford. The Aston Villa team for this game. He looks as though the manager has set up a team here. Whatever happens, we're not going to be beaten today. Does look that way, doesn't it? And uh, I hope it's not a dull affair, this, because we've seen this manager set up teams in the past and just concentrating on a clean sheet. Manchester United getting the first half underway. Pogba. Cameron Borthwick Jackson. Lindelof. Made sure the pass wasn't completed. Rashford. Good way to nick the ball back. Quick thinking. Well, I don't know. The game's uh, played on the pitch, but not on paper. But on paper, this looks uh, a canter for the home team. They won so easily the away game. Yeah, I mean, a few things. Looks the goalkeeper in the eye. Outstanding save. A full tilt. Well, he's a big lad, and he needed every inch of his height there. And that's a corner for Manchester United. And in it goes. He's got it away, and that's what you have to do. Plenty of width for the team to attack into. Pogba. Lindelof. Lukaku. Well, the wide man can... Show his skills here. Connor Hurihan. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. They spread it out wide here. Chance to get some width into this attack. I think the cross is on. Gets his cross in. That's a shame because in the end that will go down as a poor cross really Sean good strong tackle and they've got a man out wide Connor Hurihan
And that's broken up by the defender before the cross could come in. Romelu Lukaku. Oh, they gave it straight to him, didn't they? Well, he could have kept the ball, but he didn't. Chong. Aston Villa have possession again. Into the attacking third. Looking for teammates in the middle. Done well to get it wide. Not done so well with the delivery from the wide areas. Romelu Lukaku. Rashford with the ball now. Can't keep the ball at the moment. Chow. Here's Andreas Pereira. Not rushing it here. Moving from one side to the other. Maybe he'll cross it here. He's aiming for the front post. It's not a cross that's caused the defence any problems. And certainly not the goalkeeper. Opening them up with a through pass. Put in from the wide area. Good defending. Chong. Romelu Lukaku. Guided through. He's through here. Trying to pick out someone in the centre. And they get it away. McGinn. Cameron Borthwick Jackson. Shaw. He's got support here. It's a good cross. That was a scare for the defenders. Could have been a goal on the move and able to cut out the pass. Opportunity in a wider area. Going for goal! The keeper might be needed again. He didn't hang on to the ball. Here's Andreas Pereira. Chong. Could be a chance here. They've got the ball into a good area to take the lead. That did look like a real opening, but they've dealt with it. Romelu Lukaku. And shoots! He's way off target. Certainly not the best we've seen from Romelu Lukaku today, Alan. Well, yeah, I mean, the way things are, I wouldn't be surprised if he gets substituted because he looks way below par at the moment hasn't had the courage to, you know, let fly from these kind of areas and uh, as a result, his team are level. Tight against the touchline, pretty clear that it was going to end up with a throw-in. Richie Delat. Connor Hurihan. Good forward play from them. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. A bit predictable with the passing and the opposition able to deal with that. Good position for the cross. And here's a little update for you on a potential target for the Spanish club Valencia. Well, we are hearing about £35 million, pounds, Martin, which for me is good business. Show Pogba. Two more minutes to be played then, added time. Of two minutes of added time. One it has to clear it. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Put into the middle. That's so straightforward enough for the goalkeeper. Good hands, but it would have been... Well, that is half-time, and the score is nil. nil. And... Well, the ball rolling again for the second half at Old Trafford.
Here's Andreas Pereira. Pogba. It's Pereira. Lukaku. To put them in front. It's in. It's the first goal of the game, and it's gone to Manchester United. Oh, it's a well-worked effort, and you could sense it coming. got to admire the way he placed the ball into the bottom corner of the net but the goalkeeper was in a decent position but he was helpless to uh, stop that one going in Manchester United in front, as predicted, really. Conor Hurihan, James Chester. Looking for an opening with some good control build-up. This might be an opportunity to get level. And it is! There's the equaliser, and that could be a turning point in the game. Yeah, the momentum must be with them now. Can they go on and win it? Small fry they might be, but they've had a big moment here and they're level. Yeah, they've got great spirit within this team. They would not lie down and uh, who knows now. So away we go at Who's one all. Goal? Number 10, Jack Romelu Lee. Lukaku. Fogba. Rashford can whip it in now. Looking to win it back. McGinn. Well, I like the look of this attack. Now they're looking to get forward from this position. Well, down on the touchline, getting uh, the details about that injury is Jeff Shreve. Jeff. It's going to take us a while to see how bad this injury is because he got trodden on in that last challenge. So his foot is definitely a bit sore. Jeff Shreve just keeping us right up to date there. Pogba. Possession given away once more. Looking for teammates in the middle. Good power in that punch away by the goalkeeper from the cross. Hurihan. Manchester United have won the ball back here. They're cut out by the defender. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. He's had a go here. Well, that's the sign of a top class player to score like that. Well, they've got the lesser players here. Alan, but they're trying to show that the whole is greater than the sum of the individual parts, and they've got a goal. They just, what they are, Martin, is a good team. They stick together. They've got the reward here. Not looking good for Manchester United. They are trailing in this game. It's Pereira. Conor Hurihan. into the attacking third here's a chance and they have scored and they do lead now by two and they've worked very hard for this it should get them across the line at the end of the match we'll see well he's doubled up here with his second goal and he took it in excellent style just like the first one three one the score line as we restart the game Here's Andreas Pereira. Fogba. Lukaku. Rashford with the ball now. And he's in. And an opportunity to help their chances now. Still 20 minutes to go. 
Well, that's over the top of the defender and one to chase. Gets his cross in. He worked hard to get the cross in, but it didn't reach any of his teammates arriving in the middle. He could cross it now. Hopper. Now with Lukaku. The shot's on. United's corner. One matter on the corner. That's a great clearance. That would be a throw. Matter. Togba. They continue to defend as a unit, but no real attacking outlet, so the game is being played in their half. Chance to get the ball in the box. Mata! Goalkeeper can only parry it out. That's safely away. Togba. Fred. Lukaku. Read that well with the interception. Well, if noise was worth a goal, this team would not be losing this match. Put into the middle. That's a free kick against Manchester United. But that will go down against Manchester United's record in this game. A yellow card. A silly one. It could have avoided that. Trying to get close, but not like that, eh? Well, it's a definite foul, and it's poor marking. It really is. Well, he can't go for goal, but it is a dangerous situation, this, because uh, if he gets it on the money, it's going to be hard to defend against. James Chester. Conor Hurihan. He can cross it now. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. Not a good challenge by the defender. That's an excellent cross. And that's dealt with the problem. Still seven minutes left on the clock. Rumblings of discontent around Old Trafford here. As they see their team get a bit of a chasing. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. It's Pereira. Pogba. Fred. An incisive pass. Here's Mata. Can go in from here. Danger was looming large. But they've got themselves back on the ball. Burke. Rojo. Fred, Togba. Here's Andreas Pereira. Well, will be two added minutes. Has to Villa have possession again. Richie Delat. Conor Hurihan. I think the cross is on. Trying to pick out someone in the centre. Good clearance. And the winners here, Aston Villa. This is a headline result for the underdogs, a genuine surprise, not to say sensation. I think so, no doubt the favourites didn't play well, but the underdog team, well, they came out of the trucks breathing fire. But what a turnaround. The side that just haven't been able to score goals has found enough to win here. I always thought with this team, they had the look of a side that was underperforming, but they certainly didn't today.